Hey guys, hello. Welcome. Serena Bradford Gypsy. How is everyone today? Um, hang on. I had a cough and I didn't want to cough all over you. So I believe it's probably about 11, 11 right now as I go to shoot this video. I wanted to ring my bell. I sorry, I should have warned you. I do apologize for that. How's everyone today? It's Monday. Another magic Monday. Hopefully it's not manacle. <laughs> um, so first I want to start off with, I have a couple things that I would like to talk about today. And I hope everyone's having a fabulous day. And thank you, you guys. I want to say congratulations. <laughs> I don't know why I wanted to say congratulations, but um, I had to put my on-air sign on. I like it. It's cute. Um, Man, I haven't even done my coconut oil pull yet. I should have done that already, like right when you first get up. Oh, coconut oil pulling is, um, you take like a tablespoon of coconut oil. You swish it around in your mouth. Never swallow it. Make sure you don't swallow any of it because it's got yucky poison in it, right? Because it, it's it's clearing, you know, toxins and whatnot, right? Something like that. Ah, my toe. Um, for twenty minutes. Um, work your way up to twenty minutes if you can. Um, it was very difficult for me at first to even do a full tablespoon. I gagged a lot and, but when you get used to it, you get used to it. So anyway, that's a, a coconut oil pulling. It's great. And it helps with your teeth. It helps with your mouth. It helps with the tartar buildup. It helps whiten your teeth. So all around good for you. I think you could use um, other oils as well. Um, but so the download I was getting the other day was about babies, okay? I'm just going to refer to my little notes here. <sighs> so if you've been watching my videos, then you know that I have um, spoken about um, recording your own voice to um, reprogram your mind, your subconscious mind, right? To have it work for you. Have everything work for you, all the elements and everything, even your own human, you know? Because your human should be on your side. It's here to help teach you. It's here to help teach you. I don't know. Anyway. It's playing out this this stage of, of your evolution. Um, <clears throat> so the same as with adults babies so mamas daddies record your your voice to your baby to your child especially when they're babies if you get them when they're young because from zero to seven they're doing nothing but recording 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 right so they're always in that state of mind um the state of mind before right before you fall asleep right <clears throat> it's that uh, that recording I believe it's the theta state, uh, theta wave. Um, I have to look that up. I believe it's the theta. Um, please correct me if I'm wrong. I'm still half asleep. I'm not quite up yet. Um, for your babies, right? For your children. So you record you know, wonderful things for them. You know, you guys would know your own thing. Um, your babies, you know, how beautiful they are and how smart and, you know, they can achieve anything. And, you know what I mean? Like, and, and things that you want them to learn, right? So maybe have classical music in the background or another language. I mean, there's all kinds of things you could do to teach your children and us. And even as adults, but as children, they're just soaking it in the whole time. So that's a, a, a great 
um, thing that came up, but what also came up along with that, and this goes along as well with my So a Seed Teach the Children. So, So a Seed Teach the Children, which is a part of my God's Disciples Foundation, which I'm going to get back up and running. Um, I don't want to do the paperwork all over. I have all of it in, in Colorado, so I got to get out there. But, <clears throat> you know, teaching children, maybe it's like homeschooling, you know. But teaching them the ways of, 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 of earth, the ways of, of, of love and of, of God, the, the creator of all things, right? The father. And foraging and, and you know, energy and, and just love and, and how to live and survive, you know, um, and, and teach them things that are important about life. You know, school only teaches conformity and dumbs people down and gets everyone in competition, but doesn't teach them anything to live their lives in the world, in the real world. So, you know, you want your children to have a certain life? Well, teach them that. <clears throat> and remember, children learn the most by watching you. And everything you say and the energy you put out. So whether you fight in front of your children or not, you should never. But whether you do or not, your energy, they can feel that. And you are passing along to them all the shitty shit you are feeling. Okay? I was not aware of these things when I was raising my children. When I was rearing my children, I didn't know these things. And, and I was very unhealed in very toxic situations. And my children were very toxic. Horrible, right? Um, these all grown up now. Um, so, when we learn things, what do we do? We... we we teach them to other people and we assist and we try. And you know what? And if they can't let go of how you were in the past and see who you are today, then so be it. Their loss, right? You know, we, we, this is the time. No, we're, we'll, that go, that'll be in my other video. Let's stick with the baby and the teachings. So, you know, I have here um, herbs, healing, Whatever that says, etc. I don't know. Yeah, how life is! Exclamation point! Exclamation point! Exclamation point! So that's just a little tidbit on the baby thing, right? So, you know, teaching our children, and you can teach them anything, anything, and they would can learn other languages and and be super, super, super smart. At a, at a very young age, but teaching them the ways of the world, but not the materialistic, cabalist world, but the love and divine in, in the healing, in, in how we're meant to live on this planet. Showing them the different flowers and how you could use those flowers and, and these herbs and all these things for food, to drink on your skin, for health, for to eat, and for and medicine, right? Because let thy food be medicine and thy medicine be food. So I think it's fabulous. And I love, and I wanted to share that because I think that was a wonderful download that I got from Father the Most High. So, you know, um, <clears throat> well, these are suggestions, you know, and I got to pass them along to you all. Or, um, you know. What the hell would I be? What am I getting them for if I don't pass it along? Mmm. I don't need to drink out of a straw if I don't have lemon and lime in there. But anyway, thank you. I have 303 subscribers. Thank you so much. I love that number. And um, that's fabulous. Thank you so much. I love all of you guys. And thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to to reach out to me. I know, I'm hearing you. Really? Are you going to fucking look at your messages? I will. I will. <clears throat> I just follow the lead of my father. So, 
and sometimes I just follow my own lead and I get in my own little <sighs> been in my own little world doing things but I got well, a lot of my times um, spent up making a, um, a blanket for my granddaughter so I've been doing that and that you know I have to use my hands both of them so there's no time for anything else when I'm doing that I have to have it done by Christmas so it's 18th already I'm like a third of the way done maybe oh my gosh it's all right a few more days <laughs> If I get cracking at it. But anyway, I love you guys. So, you know, our children are our future. And you guys love your children and you love your babies. I know you do. And your grandchildren and, or your nieces and your nephews. Whatever. You know, if, if you run a daycare, run a, open a daycare that's different than any other daycare. I love you guys. Namaste.